she uh, pretty much was my whole life. Whoever did this will be brought to justice, I promise you. I just don't um, think I'll ever uh, Busy day at the Weather Channel as Hurricane Floyd starts to make a landfall in the Bahamas. You can see the damage is terrible, far from over. As you can see, it has damaged some trees, tore down a lot of things. It has moved. As you can see, the damage is terrible in Florida. It's moving its way up to North Carolina when it moves onto the eastern seaboard. As you can see, the hurricane has left some serious marks, and there are some still flooding in certain areas. Floyd may still be out at the eastern seaboard. Hello, thank you for tuning in to Weather Channel. I am coming from the studio, and we have Christina Abernathy from the Forecast Center. Right now we are tracking Hurricane Floyd, a very dangerous system that could see some more difficulty with forming. So let's... Hello, I'm Mike Sardell from Ransom Beach, North Carolina, where we're seeing some winds sway around and some other things. Today is September 15th, a wild night. And hello, I am Jeff Mara from Charleston, South Carolina, and this is very... Very, very bad because it's moving the winds and the trees. We have seen some flooding occurring a few days ago. We did see some flooding. Yes, we did. And we can also tell you that some things have also changed throughout the hours. It's very, very bad. And here's why you should know about Hurricane Floyd. In South Carolina, the South Carolina Dodgers eye of Floyd in the Myrtle Beach, mandatory curfew and highways jammed from Hurricane Floyd evacuation. There have been some, some tornadoes and highways jammed and barrier islands and outer bank evacuations in North Carolina from this Hurricane Floyd as it makes landfall as a Category 2. Here's the effects in Florida. Floyd skirts across Florida and power and pier damage. Five boaters went missing and from Hurricane Floyd. And we have Jeff Morrow on the scene in Charleston, South Carolina. Tell us how it's going. It's going bad here. I'm talking to you through this microphone, but it's barely even working, as you can see, because the wind is so high. It's blowing everything through, and it's not that nice when you're in a hurricane like this. Take a look at Hurricane Floyd barreling into Florida as a big Category 4 hurricane that's not going away. Evacuations have started. People are building up sheds. And how will you deal for, for for Floyd after this? Hello, I'm Bob Child, and right now we're talking about Hurricane Floyd. Right now, this is a very a deadly situation, deadly evacuation while we're talking about this. Hurricane Floyd is a Category 4 with almost a Category 5, 155 miles per hour winds, moving west at 15 miles per hour, and it is 90 miles east of San Salvador and Miles Palm Beach.